everybody, this is Trishti. Welcome back to my channel. In the last episode, I took you around old Dhaka. But in today's episode, I am going to <laughs> take you to a whole other world that exists in Dhaka itself. Yes, we are talking about Gulshan. This is a huge area which is known for its skyscrapers and corporate offices and trendy cafes and very, very expensive residential societies. Let's take you around. It's very fascinating. One of the most manicured areas in all of Dhaka is this area in Gulshan that is dedicated to embassies, high commissions and consulates of all sorts of countries. It looks spectacular in all directions. I think the next industry that the government should really focus on is tourism and hospitality. And there will be no country like Bangladesh in Southeast Asia. There is actually no country like Bangladesh in Southeast Asia. It's incredible. The nature is insane. The skyscrapers are insane. And the culture, the diversity, the languages, the religion. There's so much to learn. I am so happy right now. I am so happy right now. There is also a lake in this area called the Gulshan Lake. And there are a lot of roadside vendors selling fruits and clothes and other things. This is what it looks like. I think that's a local market for Ramzan in the area. I see a lot of food. I actually smell a lot of food. In the place of the newly developed suburb Gulshan, there was an old village called Bhola. Gulshan was founded as a planned model town in 1961 and it was originally built with the purpose of being solely residential. Everything else cropped up much later. And yes, the cars all over Gulshan are a sight. I put this reel on Instagram and it got over 3.4 million views because people just couldn't believe that this indeed is Dhaka. I own a pickup truck myself, so I couldn't stop gawking at every 4x4 that I came across. It was just incredible. IKEA has a supply chain office here. There are world banks, all sorts of world banks. Cars have drivers and drivers actually get down to open the door for the employer. It's pretty cool. This, this entire area in Gulshan is pretty mind-blowing and very, very different from what I would have thought Dhaka is like. Or you! This is very surprising. And amazing at the same time because Bangladesh is a country that deserves it all. coffee shops in the area and I am currently outside Gloria Jean's coffee. There's a Lathard bakery and patisserie next to it as well. Let's check it out. Fancy fancy. I don't know if you believe in this but I like to have my dessert first and then the meal. I'm sitting at Lathard Lathard um, bakery right now and I've ordered a raisin roll and if I have to be completely honest I am here for the AC I am shamelessly here for the AC because it's so hot, hot outside
So I've ordered a beef bagel. I already have my own coffee. <laughs> Uh, the beef bagel was for 500 taka. I've already spent 60 taka on the raisin roll. So, 560. Mm. Okay, so what I ordered is not available. I will have to change my order. Mm. Do you have a chicken steak burger? Okay. Thank you. Chicken steak burger. Chicken steak burger. That's a hundred taka more expensive. She is hoping that this is going to be good. I do not think you can ever have like an itinerary for Gulshan. Just walk around, watch old trees and new restaurants, observe people shopping, notice how different the cars are, maybe ponder over life. In the evenings though, immerse yourself in a gorgeous sunset rickshaw ride on the avenue and a good cup of fresh Bangladesh brew. I've just come here to grab a quick cup of Americano and I also want to try this place because I saw so many of North End Coffee Roasters branches all over Gulshan. So I was like, I'll just try this and then we were crossing it and I was like, okay, one coffee is made. It was very nice. Okay, I gotta go. Bye. Right now I'm in Dhaka. I spent two nights here and I'm on my way to catch a bus to Cox Bazaar. I've never been there, I did not go there on my last trip, so I'm really excited to explore Cox Bazaar and the nearby islands. Let's get going. See you in the next vlog.